Hi guys, welcome back on 18 Volts Sanctuary. So today we have a uh, audio fire, and this is the, so this is um is a football monoblock, and um, so what basically happened to that? And this MOSFETs and the power rails, rails. Oops, the other side. So you get your power supply running in. So this this a power inverter, forty ohm and six. But when this happens, on the power supply to boost high voltage on your amplifier files. So what? So what? Happen to your MOSFETs and power supply on the pure road rails. It's such a uh, well done that uh, you don't have enough voltage and MPS. So this basically can cause a short breakdown. So all these MOSFETs, 50 and 50 in on 6, start to overheat. Overheat, and when they get overheated, start to burn, and and many occasion three, which I found out on fluorine block amps on your on your power rails, you have two forty volts sitting on it, and this sets out. I F L nine six nine six forty correct you get one nine six forty and I have six forty I only nine six forty and then yeah nine six forty six forty so that four takes four takes and when it happens your power MOSFETs for your second driver to perform your audio this will close right so basically I really open the unit up took the motor screws out and got all my new spares on this end of the table and not going to forget using this thermal paste and the final shot of your unit up as I was as I was jamming you know so I just put new MOSFETs to right then you two to power up to see in any audio if not to have a dead shot on your MOSFETs so in this case this MOSFETs uh, to part six them and power 12 volt layers and and your upper I have 9640 and 640 I found only one each was open right and all of the rest of them are genuinely working MOSFETs I repeat again the genuine MOSFETs working units and when I closely examine all your low resistors, these are 22 ohm resistors, right? I found only one was burnt. I replaced one of them, and I'm going to place place another one. Right here. So, so that two just will open. You can replace them on the table. Then you can replace all six MOSFETs. Then I replace one one of RF nine six forty RF six forty right the four four. 
and something I will show you guys something when you have a empty disk right? you have your high voltage regulators on your PM side but you need to look very closely up front what I'm going to do so I tell then push them push them all the way down for this caps oh, it's more okay so you're getting that your your minus nine volts sorry sorry not minus nine huh? uh, minus five volts positive five volts positive fourteen volts and negative fifteen volts okay. but so when you get your reading up on this what do they get us minus five positive five Negative 14, positive 14. And some of them, so it's something very, very important way. You need to do any audio. Always check your caps. For the caps. In this case, I've got three caps. It's already showing up. You can blow anytime. But why is this causing the is old age and the god heat and one does this shrink your plastic and caps lead you it's pure liquid and you control circuits if you don't want to do this so that's why you do make sure your cap not damage if it is damage simple replace them Correct voltage, correct making effects, and correct sulfur degree caps. We have already in here placed that right. So yeah, that's we can move around. So now mm, we're going to work on the MOSFETs. But so far, what I did, I just replaced and put those two MOSFETs in into your home tester to put with them. So I'm going to work on the up in my my focal camera I don't need to you need to do uh, zoom in to get it um you can see color color coating you can turn into black right so let's clean on first one MOSFETs Let's meet it. So how you you can see what I'm doing. Showing one by one. So guys, if you guys have any, any comments, just leave below at the comment box. I 
Strom. Just a little bit too near that one. Just careful not to damage your turtle coil leads. So in the end, put the board out of the bus swing. That can you solder them? And my top is the stack top. So you guys will be working on this MOSFETs Always show me something Do not Let the solar lead touch the heat spin Take your time Take your, your own time Doing this properly God, you be no room for error you know. It does have a very good amp to do power up. So you can press the MMA units. So that's so when you that that so when you did your first pen generally pick up pick up your MOSFETs to line up on the edge of the edge of the uh, piece of board that allows you to do allocate and line them up In this case, this track was white color was white damage. If I reverse the MOSFET pins to join next track, that track was double layer track. This is a very common common fault getting on the MOSFETs on any any type of audio amplifiers out here. Yeah, so too, guys. Work, work your own time. Make sure every MOSFET pins are soldered correctly. Not in touch. 
or could I call it init source socket. Mm, I don't have my Y catcher. So this is going to be a, a, a good thing. You can just uh, control board. You can see you no know, burnt. Is that it's actually solder lid? And this way, the MOSFETs have been replaced. One resistor, and it's me. So now I'm working on the top RF ninety six forty. Then I'll move on RF six forty one one. So I got my RF ninety six forty. This is top and corner. I'm going to put the bottom here. Nice and good. Save it. That's not the factory. So now do one more. Then we'll move on to like the cap. Okay, the cap now go back in and replace the last. RF and RF six forty. Will be allocated Q one sixty. And I'm going to the board. Please make sure to check your high voltage um, on 250 volts rails. You know, 
right joint, which can cause a nana monk function. So on my pure board MOSFETs will place all six and two resistors so that you see on my outputs MOSFETs all done Oops, still moving on power of five volts we have 5, 14 millimeters, 14 voltage caps that we have to move shortly. Okay, now. So we have cap one. So this is one hundred megahertz or sixteen volts. Of next year. I heard a cap loose. So one is down. So many go. Just two more to go. A second cap. This is forty seven microvolts or sixteen sixteen two volts. Cap two more.
So I'm working on second cap. That is 47 Macan, yeah, 47 Macan foot at 60 volts. I choose higher voltage. You can go higher on caps, on the voltage. Yep, you can go higher on both on caps. The same spec at uh, the end. Last cap, right here, has a bolt, bolt, Also, there's also and I'm not making fits. I do apologize if I have my camera focus focus properly. So there's hundred meg hundred meg fits or sixteen fits. I'm giving and 100, 100 megahertz at 25 volts. You can go higher, you can go higher than 16 volts. So, what part of having a higher voltage? It is, it is much safer when your 14 volts. Regular to go higher, the mark function. You don't explode your caps. Caps will damage your control units. It will take your frame IC out, resistors, and leave it a corrosion. Working the last cap. So, last cap if any subscribers like to like to become a new subscriber, please do that. So I'll be more happy to welcome you, anyone on my board, on my channel. I think I'm ready to close up this amp unit before I can do that. So I will set. So you guys. Here's your caps. Here's the caps. You got a thing. I just watch over this. Is the thing on the hook putting your stone back unit? Do you have any cap? Do 
period there. Yep. Uh, my photoresistors have been Little oil box from this um, RBM. Now then, you put this in in a hand cover casing. I'll be back. Hello guys, I'm back. Thank you. It has got uh, heating components. That's cut in old it right. and then we're using a padding, foam padding, and that um I don't know if I had to have a um summer paste right here for them. Let's take that up. So, guys, that's mounting the end back. Turn all the heat sinks failed. Sealed back on. So that's one in sort of There's two. Not bad. How is it? What is possible? I got that stick to get my product. Okay. 